all right guys so in today's video i want to talk about bitcoin again real quick guys i just found a very interesting chart and um yeah i just wanted to talk about that real quick if you're enjoying these type of videos make sure to support my small youtube channel guys just with subscribing to my channel smash up the like button if you haven't already check out my patreon first link down below in the description and yeah with that being said i would say let's jump straight into the chart you can see right here guys we are currently looking at the daily time frame and we are seeing right now what basically happened over the last i would say yeah over the last uh one and a half years or so let's say over the last nine months basically we had this previous all-time high guys around 64 to about 65k right it lasted for about i would say february january uh february march april yeah for about two or three months this was basically a distribution this was basically a distribution phase and then we had uh, another sell off of about let's see 54% accumulation phase right here that lasted for about may june july for about 2 months actually and then we had another squeeze to new all time highs of about 130% to about 69k right we had another sell-off of about 48k, 48% uh, to about 33k, guys. We did manage to make a new higher low also at the same time. You can see it right here. We have this first low around 30k, another second low if you're able to hold it right now, around 35k. And also at the same time, we had this previous high around 64k, another higher high around 69k, guys so overall from the technical perspective i would say we are definitely in a daily uptrend right now this is what i can definitely tell you just from the technical perspective so the question is right now guys everyone is asking um if bitcoin is able to hold right now above thirty five thousand and five hundred dollars if you are just taking a look at the historical charts and of course this time can be different and this time can be different everyone is talking about that we are going into a bear market this and that but everyone was also talking at the same time about the potential bear market when btc was trading at this range right between 30k to about 41k and everyone who sold their bitcoins right here missed this entire move right here of about um let me pull it out real quick of about 130 percent then uh i'm pretty sure that most of the people chased again into bitcoin right here when it broke out again and right now they are selling again into weakness and this is the biggest biggest mistake retail traders are still doing guys buying into strength and selling into weakness i think right now not financial advice of course but i think right now is one of the worst um possibilities to sell bitcoin guys Right now, we are currently trading around $38,000. And you know that a lot of stuff is going on right now in this world. All this political stuff, 7.9% inflation rate and stuff like that. And Bitcoin is still holding up and Bitcoin is still trading around $38,000. Of course, if you are breaking down below the support area around 35K, then we could definitely see another sell off for another retest to about $30,000. But there is also a possibility, guys that we are just going up from here again we are putting in maybe another higher high above 69k somewhere to around 673 to about 83 84 92 thousand dollars and we are seeing another distribution phase and then another sell-off maybe to about 50k or so if you are just taking a look at the historical charts and not try to predict and not, not try to have a crystal ball and not try to see what will happen and I am so sure that Bitcoin is going below $20,000 again in the next years and this and that. If we are just taking a look at the historical charts and if we are seeing what happened in the last, I would say, nine, uh, I would say 14 months or so, you can just see we have this distribution phase, another accumulation phase, another distribution phase right here another accumulation phase and right now maybe if we are seeing the bottom again already around 33k maybe we are getting another squeeze of about 100 percent to about 76 84 92 thousand dollars guys then maybe again one or two months distribution phase whales are selling again into all these retailers who are buying into breakouts and then maybe another correction of about 50 percent back again to about forty three thousand dollars or so if you ask me 
I think this is the most realistic scenario right now. Like I said, no one has a crystal ball, no one knows what will happen in the future, but for me, if I'm just taking a look at this chart right now, this looks definitely quite realistic in my opinion. Or what do you think, guys? Let me know down below in the comments. Otherwise, the worst case scenario right now, of course, if we are going back, for example, to 2017, for uh, if you take a look right now, here on 2017, guys, we could, of course, see another sell of about 84, 85% from the top. What I'm definitely not expecting right now, because I was already talking about that a couple of times in one of my last videos about Bitcoin, guys. I definitely do not expect another sell off from the top of about 80%. Because if you are going down 80% from this previous all time high, guys, Bitcoin would go down to about $13,000 again. And do you really think that Bitcoin is going down back again to about 13K? With all this stuff going on, inflation rate 7.9%. Bitcoin is getting fundamentally stronger and stronger. I think we are getting right now to the strongest fundamental um, cryptocurrency time ever, guys. A lot of businesses are, are already um, accumulating Bitcoin and stuff like that. So I think right now the most realistic scenario is that we are getting maybe another sell-off. Let's say to about, I would say, 32, 30K or so, just to scare all of these retail traders who are already scared guys and then this is the this will be the zone most likely where retailers are getting out at this area this zone right here is the zone where whales just uh, where whales are just scaring retail traders everyone will get out of and everyone will sell their bitcoins oh my god we are getting into a bear market and then most likely we are getting just another push of about 100% to about 80k or so if you ask me, this is a very realistic scenario, guys. For now, um, the biggest um, resistance we have to take out to get a potential bull cycle again. If you are just taking a look at the past price action, guys, you can see every time we had a successful breakout. You can see right here, for example, very clear we had this big resistance at approximately $41,300. Then we had, of course, this fake out and then a poten uh, and then finally a confirmed breakout about 41K. And then we uh, we gone up of about, let's see, let's take this previous resistance to so this previous all time high. We had a squeeze of about 70%. So let's take right now this resistance around 45K and let's just Imagine we are getting another squeeze of about 70%. This would bring a target of about $76,000, guys. So this is a potential area to get to take out some profits if you're already buying right now. And if you bought Bitcoin, let's say everywhere between 33 to about 45K, this would be a potential take profit area at approximately 76K. Otherwise, if we are getting a confirmed breakout like we saw, for example, right here in 2020, right, where we uh, did manage to break out from this previous all time high um, at approximately 19600 $19, dollars, we had this successful breakout and you see that a lot of momentum is getting in is coming in and a lot of new retail traders are also buying then of course you can hold longer and then you can maybe expect prices of about one hundred thousand dollars or so but for me if i'm just taking a look right now at the last 14 months i think right now would be a potential take profit area at approximately like i already mentioned 76 77 thousand dollars guys because um no one knows if you are getting another uh, all-time high breakout above 69k if this will be a sustainable breakout if this will hold and i will just take profits especially not only on bitcoin guys but also on some uh, layer one altcoins like for example avex solana luna and uh, so on and um yeah on bitcoin i will definitely make sure to take out some profits if you are getting another squeeze to about 76 80k or so because like i said i'm not trying to predict and i don't have a crystal ball at, and i don't want to be one of these moon boys who are telling you all right we are going to 100 or 200k this year no one knows what will happen in the future i just know that last time we had a squeeze from this resistance of about 70 percent and if you are getting another squeeze of approximately 70 percent from this previous resistance right now around 45k this would be a potential squeeze to about seventy six thousand dollars guys and this is what i'm looking out for right now and otherwise like i already mentioned 
this area everywhere between 28 29k to about 35k will be the biggest accumulation zone for me in my opinion if you're breaking down because this will be a big trigger point what i think for a lot of retail traders i think if btc is breaking down again below 33k i think a lot of retail retail traders start selling and this is where i will just buy every bit i will just buy with every money that i have guys this is basically my plan and the question is only right now if we are if you are if you are seeing already um the bottom around 33k or if you are getting another um sell off to about 29 31 30k or so and yeah that's basically it guys i just wanted to show you this chart i think it's definitely quite interesting like i said watch out for a confirmed breakout in the daily time in the daily time frame about 45k and watch out for the support right now between 35 to about 33k guys and yeah, if you're enjoying these type of videos a little bit longer, not only a two or three, four minute video, guys, make sure to let me know down below in the comments. If you have any suggestions for me, guys, what I want, uh, what I should talk about, not only on Bitcoin, but also on some altcoins, let me also, don't, uh, let me also know down below in the comments. And um, yeah, with that being said, subscribe to my channel. If you haven't already, guys, check out my Patreon to get all of my trade setups and make some money, not financial advice, of course. And um, yeah, smash up the like button turn on the notifications bell to get updated guys and i will see you tomorrow again for another update on bitcoin guys bye bye